my friends, this is MD Vegan. Yes, it doesn't take much to fly. Just be vegan and you are beyond. That's all you need. <clears throat> that's not just a belief, friends. That's a fact. Yeah, I mean, most of you watching the video now are already vegan, I guess, or on the way. And if you need some more support, be sure. If you do anything, anything to change your life, to make the planet better and mankind better, it is veganism first. It's the first choice. And there's no exception to that. So, I can reason for that, argue for that. If you have questions, if you have doubts, you can always ask me on the Facebook site or on my YouTube channel. I will definitely answer, because that is the most important question of all. And um, it is based on the Trinity of um, Ahimsa, you know, not doing violence, not harming anybody to the animal friends. They deserve their own rights, as we do. We have human rights already. Animals don't have it so far. We need animal rights first, then we need to care of the ecology, so our nature, to preserve it. And third is our health. All these are one. We can't take care of our health without thinking about the ecology and the animal welfare. That's impossible. Think about that. If you have questions, doubts, please ask me. Today, very simple recipe to make it possible and very easy to become vegan is a mango soup, a cream mango soup. I have just three ingredients. It is so easy, it can't be easier. Because there's one little obstacle, and that's the mango. Because to get a mango, really good, sweet, and mango we mango, you have to make some effort or to be very lucky. Because once you're in India, mango is holy, <laughs> almost. It's considered an ancient food with so many health benefits, for example, for the skin. They eat mangoes a lot for the good skin. That's Ayurvedic knowledge. They have many good reasons for that. You can read the science of it. Mango is a wonderful fruit, very healthy, and uh, it's so delicious. And in India, you find the best mangoes ever. And here, we have to be careful. Is it a good mango? Is it tasty? Is it ripe, sweet? It's not so easy to find one here. Of course, they have their seasons in India too. Recently, I've been there, out of season, so I couldn't get a good mango. But usually, you get it easily in here. You have to be, always make sure. If it's a good mango and it's not too expensive, you can't always, all the time, buy all these expensive mangoes. Indian is very cheap, of course. So I found some very good ones this time, but they are small. The ones I found in the health food shop were small. Small green mangoes. And a lot of work to peel them, because with the regular mangoes, the big ones, the skin, the peel, is not so bitter. So I can take the whole mango with the skin, not the, not the kernel, not the, the stone goes away, but the skin, you can usually take the skin into the soup, on a smoothie, on a juice, no problem. But with these small, little green mangoes, it's impossible, almost, for me. Because the, 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 the skin is so bitter, you know, you can't eat it. It is even tangy, you know, that is really, it pulls everything together. So I couldn't take that. So I had to peel the mango, a lot of work. And with the small green mangoes, you have only a little bit of flesh left over <laughs> when everything is away and you don't need. You can have a vegetable peeler, veggie peeler, very, very thin peeling, okay. But still, there's not, not much left. So you have to have a lot of mangoes, very expensive, but the flavor is really worth it. If you have a regular mango, you can even take some of the peel, if you like it, you try it. Together with the coconut milk, it is okay, because coconut milk is a very strong, um, is a fatty, and it's very strong with the flavor. It can take a lot of flavor that you don't like, harmonize the whole thing. So that's a good part of coconut milk, one of the good parts. So I put the mangoes here. It's maybe not, yeah, maybe two cups of mango flesh, maybe one and a half or so. And I have the same amount about of um, coconut milk here. This was canned. Yeah, you have to be careful with the coconut. It should be from the organic and health, uh, uh, and um, from the. It should be good. Um, it should be a good source for the mango of the, of the coconuts because sometimes um, they take the little monkeys and force them to pick them. So um, uh, you better get uh, fair trade ones and 
take care that the mango, the, the, the coconuts come from these mango, these 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 um, horrible people who who force the, the little the little monkey friends to do that job. So this is a dried mango that I can get easily at the health food shop. Also different qualities, but I take a little bit of that to make the soup creamier and also to enhance the flavor a little bit. That's always a nice trick. Um, to use the dried fruit also, together with the fresh fruit, to enhance flavor and um, the creaminess. And I have a little bit of black salt. This is uh, very special too. It's also from India. It's an Ayurvedic salt. There's a lot of um, minerals in it. It's a little bit of... Um, very, it's very healthy, but you can take only a little bit. Only It's for health reasons. And this, of course, has a special flavor that makes... Um, the mango soup a little bit more soupy, you know, more spicy. And this I will blend together with my blender dance, and I see in a second what happens to my soup here, to all these nice ingredients. <laughs> We have the coconut, especially the coconut milk, the coconut cream from the can. It happened that it, it won't really easily dissolve and get smooth. So probably I have to, to check, the, uh, better check the, the texture. Together with the flavor. Mm, nice. Mm, right. I put some more water. That's an easy one. Just some water. Have some more coconut milk ready. You can use that, but a little bit of water. We won't, do, we won't do any wrong here. Just a little bit more liquid. subscribe and leaving on YouTube and have another recipe every single day. 